not even on my birthday. Hello everyone and welcome back to some more Hogwarts Legacy. Today we're just going to be going around Hogwarts and seeing what uh, missions we can do and finish so that we can, you know, do the house cupping mission. So we've got this guy, this person here. If I could have a moment of your time. Let's go and talk to him. We still have a lot of quests to do, so we're going to talk to him first. Hello, Sophronia. That was quite the quiz you gave me. What are you up to now? Good test of one's knowledge, isn't it? I'm actually working on something equally interesting, but need help from a fifth year, so it's good you came along. Are you familiar with Herodiana Byrne? <laughs> Don't answer that. Of course you're not. No one seems to know of her but me. She's only the single greatest Depulso master of all time, even taught at Hogwarts, briefly. How interesting. I'm amazed I've never heard of her. It's a travesty she's not more well known. I often read about great witches in my limited free time. There are many. Whilst reading about her, I learned that she built a secret to Pulso training room here at Hogwarts. But in typical clever Herodiana fashion, one cannot access it unless one knows to Pulso, which of course, third years aren't taught. And you're a third year, so... Quick one, aren't you? According to what I've read, her signature outfit may still be there. I would love to see it. Would you get Herodiana's signature outfit and show it to me? If you tell me where to go, I'll see what I can do about it. Simply go to the Hall of Herodiana. It's at the base of the Defense Against the Dark Arts Tower. There, you'll find a series of Depulso puzzles, concealing pieces of Herodiana's ensemble. Very well. I shall let you know if I find anything. I can't wait to see Herodiana's famous ensemble. No, I hate. Perhaps I'll make myself a copy. Let's do that. We still have a lot of quests to do with another. Suppose I should look for that secret hall Sophronia told me about. It does sound interesting. Let's check this out, actually. We need to have our Depulso um, spell set here, which is kind of weird. Spare a moment? I could use your help. The pulse. This must be the entrance to the Hall of Herodiana. Let's see what lies in this place. I hope not something too scary. I really don't like scary things. I had a feeling we had to use Depulso for this quest. Now to see if Herodiana Byrne was as good as Sophronia said she was. Depulsa. Okay, this one we can just do that, I think. There's a chest in there. What does that do? Is that something? Akio! Bombarder! Okay. Right. I thought that did something, I don't know. That chest that was interesting. That wasn't too hard. What was that? What do we have to do with this? Akio! Oh, we need this guy. I think we killed ourselves with that. There's a chest there, but I don't want to get it. Is that probably what it's going to do? Oh, sorry. I think we may have 
Reset everything. Oh, good to know. Akio. Oh, yeah. I was. Uh, all right. Well, that was interesting. I didn't want to. Get That's this the last of them. Seems I was a match for Herodiana Burn after all. And this must be the last piece of Herodiana's ensemble. It is remarkable. No wonder Sophronia wants to see this. Well, I was. I think I kind of messed up with some of those puzzles, but whatever, we do what we do. We're going to be doing all the Hogwarts quests, and we've got some in Hogsmeade, we've got some, like, just around the world. Those, I don't think there's really a need to do, we just have to get our levels up to level 34, which is going to be hard, because we are only 28 right now. So, we're going to at least need 6 levels to get to uh, level 34, which is going to be a little tough, but we can try to see what we've got. I wonder if you might be able to help me with a small, uh, project. Sure, bud. We still got quests, um, that are, we have on our main thing. We have to go check them out, so. And let's go take, uh, tell, uh, what's her name? Sofria? Sofriana? I don't know what she was called. Oh, you got a cave for that, did you? Before we just go and talk to her, we've got to some type of cave.
I'm not a huge fan of the, the keep does look nice and I think I might use it in the future but I don't think for now I don't think it's really a must a beginner's guide to transfiguration Sophronia, I solved all the puzzles in the Hall of Herodiana. Incredible! Then you found Herodiana's outfit. May I see it? Of course. Behold. Oh, how grand! You look as majestic as Herodiana herself, the greatest Depulso master of all time. You're my second favorite hero! Oh, well, thank you. Got some more quests uh, here, poppy blooms. Oh, did we not finish the end? We haven't spoke to Poppy yet. Well, Poppy, I shall be coming for you then if I haven't spoken to you yet. I, we still didn't finish off that part of the quest. Interesting. I might do some of these quests like by myself if I really need to. But we we will see. I don't think it's we don't really need to uh be too uh too crazy right now in terms of what we can do, so To have any we just Revelio. The lag is still going on. It's kind of low. Just the person I was hoping to see. I see Doran finally convinced you to leave the Smidgets. If anyone can keep them out of poacher hands, it's the Centaurs. And I wanted to thank you. When the poachers ambushed us, I... It was nice not to face them alone. Of course. It's the sort of thing friends do for each other, isn't it? I suppose so. I am glad you came to Hogwarts. It's already been my best year. I wouldn't want a repeat of Hauntel Hall, of course, but I did enjoy the Three Broomsticks. Had no idea how lovely it was there. Had you never been to the Three Broomsticks? I used to spend most of my time with Highwing, and, well, I don't know how Serona feels about hippogriffs popping in for a butterbeer. Highwing's the only one I would have gone with. Or Gran, of course. Nothing wrong with that. Highwing's good company. She is. Although I am beginning to see the appeal of, uh, human friends. It was nice to talk about my parents and Gran with someone. And share Highwing. It has all been a pleasure, Poppy. Do try and stay out of trouble. Don't know that I can. We've taken on poachers twice now, successfully. I rather think you've helped me develop a taste for it. And with centaurs as allies, I might actually go looking for trouble. Ah, oh, Poppy. You and I should meet for a butterbeer soon. Perhaps Highwing can join us? Of course. You can always get Highwing to come. Alright. Anyway. Sequence of competition. Right, we need to do this. Let's have a look. I don't think yet. I'm ready for this just yet. Yep. So here we all the way in Hulk to the Hulk Let's head over to Hogsmeade. We've got a lot of quests to do. I think we definitely do. It is really annoying because even though it is fun to play these quests, it is kind of difficult to get to that house cup, which is level 34. You seriously have to be playing for like hours and hours and hours to get that done, but I don't think it's that bad. I think as long as you complete the main story part of the game and you complete like the 
house cup because the house cup is the last bit of story i believe before the game really ends um, in honest opinion so so that's what we really have to focus on so yeah well, after we're done that i think i'm gonna end the video maybe try to see if we can do the hufflepuff azkaban quest i think i might have to make a new character and do that so the good thing is you can have four different characters in one which is amazing so See what happens. Hogsmeade, here I come. <laughs> what the hell was that? Did you guys hear that weird lady just. No, that was a bit strange. Welcome back. I've arranged a special price on the broom upgrade for you. I truly appreciate all of your help. What are we looking for today? 1,000 for a broom upgrade. Why don't I just get a new broom? Uh, uh, increase your room's acceleration speed. You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. Thanks for stopping by. Hope to see you again. Alright, well. We can't move yet, so. I must tell you, half of Oxmead's been by the shop asking about rumours of a broom upgrade. Without the information you provided, my work would have taken twice as long. Thank you again. It may sound ambitious, but I've already begun work on another upgrade, more difficult to perfect than the last. I wondered, would you be interested in joining forces again? There's another course near Irondale that Miss Reyes has mastered. If you were to test this first upgrade there, it may help me as I develop the next. Oh, you'll consider it, won't you? Sounds as if you're really outdoing yourself. If I'm able to help, I will. Thank you. I know this recent success was only the beginning of what I can do for Broom Flight. All right, so Report back as soon as you can, and we'll be off to the races. How far is she? 2,000 kilometers, 2,100 meters away. It's 2,500 meters, I guess. She's far. Why is she so far? Luckily, we can just fast travel to an area closer. So I'm just going to try to finish the quests I at least have on my quest. Maybe at least we can get that done and then... Yeah, and then we can go and focus on some Hogwarts quests, some Hogsmeade quests, and then we should be level 34 and finish off the House Cup, which is going to be great. And then we're done with these with this series, which is going to be kind of sad, because I know you guys this enjoy could it. prove dangerous if I'm not careful. I wonder how long I'm here. Definitely faster. Oh yeah, definitely. We're a lot faster. Uh, we have to go uh, this way. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 
Here we are. Mr. Weeks wasn't wrong about the mountain views. If it isn't the fastest Gryffindor. Hello, Imelda. So, another trial? Of course it's another trial. And you'd better be taking part. Does this mean you've changed your mind about me? Well, you're a step up from the good-for-nothings who usually challenge me. Well, they sit around and hope to be the best. I put in hours of practice. No one sets records by wishing for them. And I need strong competition to stay on top of my game. Are you going to try to beat my flying record or not? I'm ready to fly. Finally, a decent challenge. All right, let's do this one. I don't think it's going to be, I think it's going to be a lot harder. So, we have to wait ready for this one. Made it! six seconds faster and we didn't miss a entire length. Our flying has gotten a lot better since our first ever uh, flying lesson. You guys can go see that video if you want. That video we were, huh, we were really bad at flying. I think it's going to be flying a broom and taking broom lessons. So. All of my siblings have finished. You've improved, I must admit. That was a bloody good run. Be careful. Earn a reputation for talent around here, and some people get put out about it. Sounds like you're speaking from experience. Yes, well, I am. Anyway, you didn't do abysmally. I can't deny that. But you'll not have the same luck on the South Coast course. We'll see, won't we? Till next time. I half expected you to back down. Rest on your laurels. See you at the South Coast trial. If you don't lose your nerve. All right, well that to race this course again, the visit the podium the with the leaderboard, the where you can start the race and check your time. All right, we have to return to... I'll be back to Hogsmeade we go. have a lot of stuff to do I think before finishing all of this stuff but that's okay because we're having a lot of fun so that's good 
This is the Harry Potter game I think everybody dreamed of, if I'm being honest. If I'm being very honest, this was the game that everybody dreamed of. They wanted to play it and they wanted to have fun. I do feel that there are small little areas of this game that can be abruptly improved, such as the controls for flying and all. I feel that's kind of annoying and it, and it takes kind of used to. It kind of takes used to kind of like getting used to flying it, you know. So I definitely think that's a few things I would work on to improve this game overall. Apart from that, I would say Quidditch, um, Patronus Charm. Those are the small things I would like to see in this game. Apart from that, everything else is perfect. It's a perfect Harry Potter game. Apart from that, every, like honestly, there's nothing else I would change. People say that... Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? People say this game needs a little bit more, like... Back from your latest flight. I want to hear all the particulars. Good news, Mr. Weeks. With your upgrade, I was able to set a new record at the Irondale course. Brilliant! I knew the upgrade had fantastic potential. How did your broom feel? It rides well. Does get a tad shaky at top speed, and the handle wobbles a bit when I hit a strong gust of wind. Ah, oh, yes. Hmm, I see. I think I know how to address that. Thank you. I owe you one. If it means another upgrade, the pleasure's all mine. You sound as determined as I am to improve broom flight. It's a joy to have a collaborator like yourself. If I'm right, and I do hope I am, you'll be hearing good news from me soon. Thank you again, truly. You're one of the students who sent Theophilus Harlow to Azkaban, aren't you? I can't thank you enough for that. Oh, well, Mr. Weeks and I do make a good team. All right. See, we've got some requests to do. Um, let's check out some of these quests. The man behind the moons, yeah, we have to do this as well. This is... Uh, this. Uh, this one we're gonna have to do off camera. I don't think you guys will be interested to find that. Let's go talk to Adelaide Oaks. She must be in Hogwarts, if I'm correct. I have thrilling news. I believe my next broom upgrade to be even more impressive than the last. Come by Spin Witches as soon as you can. Wow. I, I do want to do it as well. But let's go do Adelaide's thing and then we can do this in the next one. Yeah, I think I'll be done with the video then. It's just how much how long have we been recording for? Yeah, 10, 30 minutes. It's not that bad. Oh, we have enough for just one more quest. I'll do the moon stuff I think behind the scenes. I don't think I wanna trouble you guys with that. I don't think you guys would even be intrigued in that type of stuff, so there's no need for there's no need to do that. So we can get the different Alhamoras and then it's called Alohamora, but people call it Alahamora for some reason in this game. Like I've heard three people call it Alahamora now, which is kind of weird because it's Alohamora. But it is what we it is what it is, right? This game is just Way too crazy. The fun that you have in this game, I don't think it compares to anything else, if I'm being very honest. The stuff you can do, the things you can fly on. We only have three animals in which we can really fly on, which is Buckbeak, not Buckbeak, sorry, the High Winged, Caligo, which is our male, uh, male Hippogriff, and then our female. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I it's already dark outside. Oh, in the name of God. Yeah, let's talk to her over here. Adelaide Oaks, isn't it? I received your owl. Yes, I'm Adelaide Oaks. Oh dear. You see, 
My uncle Roland is a metal trader who's quite well known in the goblin community. He normally sends me owls every week when he's on his business travels. In his last owl, he alluded to dealings with those radical goblins, Ranrock's loyalists. It's been ages since that owl and I'm worried. What with the troll attack on Hogsmeade and the rumours that goblins may have been involved, well, I'm fearing the worst. Should I be worried about my uncle, or am I overthinking this? I think you're right to be concerned, Adelaide. Your uncle may be in trouble. You're much more understanding than Professor Weasley. She heard I was going to look for him and forbade me from leaving the grounds. She's convinced he can handle himself, but I can't concentrate on anything until I know he's all right. I... Uh, could you try to find out for me? From what I hear, you're almost as adventurous as Uncle Roland. I'll try and look into it for you, Adelaide. Thank you. He's very thorough in his record-keeping, notes all his trades in a journal, makes maps. In fact, in his last owl, he drew me a map of his next stop. He planned to set up camp north of here. I do hope you're able to find out where he is. Thank you again for any help you can provide. I hope Adelaide's Uncle Roland is all right. She seems very worried. Adelaide mentioned her uncle's camp may be near Brockborough, past the river. Nice uh, cloudy morning here in Hogwarts. Could this be Ranrock's loyalists? Just ahead of of his trades, maps. Perhaps these landmarks will lead me to him. What is this? Mr. Oakes' trade journal. Uh, Ryan Rooks agreed to me where I don't fear his attack and easy. They amended their request and were angry. That's why I don't have ever heard of their plan go with me. They're after my rare metal deposits that are still good for drilling. Afraid of second go further. They seem rather volatile. I need this transaction to happen correctly to sort of compromise perhaps not. Follow the map. Okay, we have to follow that map that we just got. So I believe this is the, the thing that you wrote was the campsite. Let me quickly see this again. It'll be probably in our inventory. A rock formation? That's the first landmark on this map. Now to find the crooked tree. A crooked tree, just as the map said. The crumbling tower shouldn't be far from here. 
nothing to poach in Aaron Jury except for the mine. I think that's the cricket tower. And the crumbling tower. The spot on the map should be directly south of here. What do we have here? Hmm. I may have more luck higher up in the keep. Revelio. This is the spot on the map. I'd best have my wits about me. I've been fighting since before you were born. She kind of was just like, we have to go west, and then I just went west, but I didn't exactly go west, I went south, in some type of way, I don't know. I can't read a compass, to be honest. I just kind of, I guess I kind of just got lucky. Alright, here we are. What will we find in here? will be fulfilled. <laughs> it's punishment to us all to have that miserable human around. Things were spot on. To learn the error of your ways. A boiler door. How to open it? Oh, we got one of these again. 
Revelio. You're going the wrong way this entire time. Great. I Rebellion.
Hello? Mr. Oaks? Yes, I'm here. They've taken my wand. This cell has an enchanted lock. I have experience with these locks, but I need my wand if I have any chance of opening it. Look for a boiler door. I've heard them speak of it. I need to find Mr. Oaks' wand. Where could it be? Revelio! So you have to go back there and find his wand. That same boiler area there fought a bunch of those lunatics. Confringo! This must be Mr. Oaks's wand. Perhaps now he can set himself free. Powerful spells for now, just in case we go up to people against any people. How do I forget to get to Pass me my wand. I can't get out of this damn cell without it. It's my last hope. Please. Get a bit away from here in case he has to like blow it open. You did it! I found my wand and wait, you're a student? Oh, we must get you to safety immediately. It's dangerous. It's all right, Mr. Oaks. I've dealt with these goblins before. Dear Merlin, you're either very lucky or very talented. Well, how did you find me? I'm a friend of Adelaide's. She was worried about your business with Ranrock's loyalists. Oh, she was right to be. I couldn't go through with the agreement, and when I told them, I ended up blindfolded and behind bars. Been locked in that infernal cell for so long, they'd forgot I was even there. I overheard things. If only I could reward you for what you've done. Blasted goblins stole every canut on me. All I can say is thank you, truly. I'm grateful I was able to help you, Mr. Oaks. Adelaide thinks the world of you. Oh, and I her. She's become quite savvy to my trading habits, always analyzing my detailed owls. Oh, if only I hadn't resorted to trading with such fiends. A lesson I shan't soon forget. Having my wand back is like being reunited with an old friend. I must return home and inform Adelaide of my safety. Will you be all right? I'll be fine, Mr. Oaks. You get back to Adelaide. I assure you. Her worries outweigh yours. Oh, I'm anxious to see my dear niece. And then I plan to travel far from here for my next round of trading. Thank you. May life reward you justly for your deeds. Be well, my friend. Mr. Oaks was lucky. Hanrock's lot would never have freed him. Right. I crafted methods. I have no idea how to get out of here. Fold you all to your demise. Ah, uh, every time, man, we have. We just sell some of these, these keys when I go back down. Uh, we're gonna see what some of this stuff is, by the way. We have to go back to the requirement as well. Last of all, they're 
to get the hell out of here, but I don't know where the exit is. How have I lost my way in here? Are you kidding me? It must be up here. Man, I didn't want to lose my way out of here. That would have been embarrassing. We have structured our wand. We don't exactly have. Okay. I don't like the looks of that encampment. I hope you have. Hey, for your information, I received an owl from her just the other day. And as for her affection, oh, I can assure you. It's been ages since I found anything worth poaching their crack crop. I kind of feel sad for you know, for push, pushing Sebastian in. in that episode we played, we came to about this way all the way over to Fox I felt really sad for doing that, but okay. Alright guys, I think that's going to do it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching and I shall see you in my next one.